fresh meat light on the turnout but we got some fantastic cars here that we're going to show you we're with introduce yourself i'm d your squad press okay oh you're the president okay d has a very nice audi a4 okay by turbo by turbo 2.0 okay uh, so far i did a uh, exhaust intake I did the twin tips on the rear. Okay, we're gonna take a look at that in a minute. Okay, I did a nice sound system on the air. Line. Okay, so what we're gonna show you is this air suspension, which is really cool. I noticed it when he came in, he parked, and then he just dropped the car, which you know air suspensions do that. But you want to give us uh, now performance-wise, you said you have the Ford blower valve. Is it chip? Yes, I did um, stage two uh, air line. Stage two Eurodyne, and how much horsepower is that supposed to be put uh, now? Right now, I'm, I'm only at like a 320 or something. Only at 320 for a street uh, car, yeah, all wheel uh, drive. That means all that power is going to all four wheels. I uh, mean, you said you have a sound system also. Yeah, something really small. Like all right, so you want to walk us through that and show us that? Yeah, yeah we did the inverted air, air ride setup where you still have the, the space for your spare tire and a little music. I did two tens uh, sundown to get a nice space and uh, everything neat and still keep accessible to them. And what tips are those on the car? Uh, those are actually the magnet flow quad tips. We're, we're here with a, another Euro squad car and if you guys know me, you know this one particular body style that I love and that's a station wagon. A station wagon and anything is my favorite and he rolled in again with his squad and I saw him do the same thing park drop it down and on the station wagon it was extra sexy to me. Introduce yourself. I'm Looney from Eurosquad. Uh, I drive a 2013 all road on airlift bags and right now little little work to the engine nothing crazy. So let me ask you, why did you choose a station wagon? I've always been a, a wagon lover. I've always loved it for the space. It could be as a daily, you could throw your tools, throw your stuff, hit the road and don't have no complaints. No same reason why I like it, though. same reason why I like it. All right, so you want to tell us what else? Like the rims, what you got on? Uh, Ferrata FR2s, had them custom gunmetal machine faced. Um, did the calipers orange. Uh, ECS air intake, carbon fiber cover. Any flash? Not yet. Not yet? Nah. Or come to it. It'll be flash for Atlantic City. Okay. Definitely. All right, well, definitely a sexy ride. Thank you for bringing it out. Sir. Okay. VIP. It usually stands for very important people. But in the car world, it stands for a car that's done to the max. Now, a lot of guys say their cars are VIP, but they don't have all the elements that makes a car a VIP. Curtains, custom wine holder, custom interior seats, usually with the cross seated setup, leather, carpet, stereo. You need all of that to be considered a VIP. And this gentleman came through like a real VIP. What's your name, buddy? Mike. Mike? Thank you, Mike. So tell us about your car. It's a 90, it's a 06 G35 sedan. Fully custom interior by me, Anthony Mendoza, and on um, Proline Audio of Brooklyn. Um, oh, another Proline Audio car. Yeah, well, they just did like the trunk and stuff. Right, okay. So I, I did move to the interior. 
and I had help from one of my friends, Anthony Mendoza. He did custom doors and stuff. Right. So all the stitching and stuff was done by Mendoza? Yeah. Okay, very nice. And you laid out the design, I'm guessing? Yeah, I laid out the design. I did all the suede on the roof, the interior, the doors, okay. the middle console. What about the curtain? I, that was all me. Okay. I did that. One of the things that make this car a true VIP, apart from the curtain, is the wine case which we showed you. So whose idea was that with the lights in the middle? That was mine. Yeah? That was all mine. Okay, very good, man. Your rims. I like your rims. They stand out. What was, it? What was the idea behind that? Well, I was looking for a color that makes the blue pop. Right. The first thing that came to my head was like a Pepsi can, the blue with the red. Awesome. So that's why I decided to do the candy apple red with the chrome lip, and it kind of looked like a Pepsi can. Awesome. I think it looks better than a Pepsi <laughs> can. Uh, okay. Very nice. You want to tell us about the system? Well, the, the system that I have is all Bama interior, rock phosphate amps, and sundown for base. Very nice. Very Running nice. over 20,000 watts. Wow. Now, any any mods to the engine or just dress up? Just dress up for now with a um, 300 amp alternator. Okay. And then next I'm working on a supercharge and the whole engine big chrome. Wow. Very nice. So phase two, phase two of this car, I'm going to look forward to seeing. Thank you again for bringing it out. Great job. All right. Thank you. Okay.